Hello everyone. Today I would like to talk about the feeling of being lonely. So what to do when you really feel lonely and you crave to be in a relationship, to have a husband or to have maybe a boyfriend, whatever you um, crave for. So um, I can definitely understand what um, you're feeling because because for me it was a really big topic for years. So even when I was in a committed relationship, I had this constant chronic feeling of being lonely. And when we broke up, I kind of cling to another man because I felt lonely. And I didn't want to walk away because I felt lonely. And then, when I was starting to work with a coach, and she told me, Elizabeth, like, this is not, this is not something we're going to continue doing. Like, um, just like clinging to someone because you feel lonely. Then I kind of met my needs by just working a lot um, um, at this at a bank like with customers so I was working so much and also after work work um, it was before the COVID-19 Bef after work I would go out with friends go on circular dates because I couldn't be home alone because I felt so lonely all the time this chronic feeling of loneliness so if you can relate um, let me know and back then I thought, wow, when I have a boyfriend or a husband, this feeling will go away. And sometimes it even did when I got a lot, 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 lot of attention. But immediately when I didn't get any attention, I felt lonely again. So you can see how I felt extremely dependent on the outside world to fulfill my um, need to um, be okay being by myself and um, I must tell you that I'm so lucky and happy that I've spent the whole year 2019 working on my inner self um, connecting to my inner child because now it's so different I feel so fulfilled alone and I can see and hear myself. And of course, it doesn't mean that I will never meet people, that I don't need to be in a relationship. Of course, um, we can have those beautiful things too. But um, can you see the difference when I'm coming um, out of an empowered place, out of a healed place um, of being completed by myself and and out of this de um, develop abundant mindset, knowing that, well, if you don't give me the attention that I crave, someone else will. And um, honestly, this is just so, so, so beautiful for me to experience because for many years I had the same pattern and the same feeling of loneliness. And first, I know the tools how to see and hear myself. So um, you can go back to other videos to know how to do that. But second, I'm also developing a really abundant mindset, not only out of money, but also um, about uh, love and attention. So I can share you maybe um, a little... Um, story of mine so um, for example when I was at a date with a guy lately and he kind of just walked away like he went somewhere and I was then alone and then I just talk, start talking to like strangers because um, we have been out in a park and I just start talking to strangers because yeah, why should I just sit there alone? So I was thinking about just going home, but 
um, I started talking to strangers, and then he came back, um, and then he realized, wow, like, she doesn't wait for me to, like, give her attention, I better not go anywhere else, so, uh, I don't know if you can follow, but I just realized that I no longer depend of a man to fulfill all my needs, so right now, of course, I have, I'm doing circular dating, so if this die guy isn't a fit, I can date someone else but when you're in a committed relationship you also don't have to like rely on this one man to give you the attention and and company there's so many other people out there even strangers but also your family and friends okay i hope this helps so share with me um if you can relate if you have ever felt lonely and how you overcome it but and if you don't know how to overcome it, then drop a question. I'll be happy to give you a little bit feed of feedback. Okay.